What we're trying to do is get an overview that makes some sense. Whether you then end up supporting China, criticizing China, or some mixture, that's left to you. Okay. First of all, let's begin by saying it really is a phenomena what China has done. It deserves everyone's awesome recognition of that fact. What do I mean? Well, it's this is the greatest story of economic growth that we probably have in the history of the human race. Here was a country over the last 70 years the largest by population in the world, with well over a billion and approaching a billion and a half people in unspeakable poverty as little as 70 years ago, one of the great horror stories of poverty in the world. And in those 70 years, this country has raised a billion or more of those people out of abject poverty, and into the modern world. With that sized population, that's never been done before. If you take all of Europe together, which is a quarter of the population of China, it took them two to three hundred years to do something comparable to the economic growth record of China in 70 years. It is extraordinary. Many other features of China are less extraordinary. There are good things and bad things one can say about it. No one is denying that. But when it comes to economic growth, to escape from poverty, to produce a modern economic reality in terms of the production and distribution of goods and services, That goal, which is the major goal of most people on this planet and has been for the last 70 years, there's one outstanding performer and no one else comes close. That's the People's Republic of China. And whatever else you may think about or decide about this society, Pretending that what I just said isn't the case is not going to make your understanding one whit better. It's going to make it worse. 